orchestra. We recorded with my orchestra in Vienna, the Vienna Radio Symphony, and then a new orchestra that I'm just starting now called Go, the global orchestra. The members all joined in, and then really, I think this has been the most wonderful part of it all. The Stay at Home Choir joined us, and this choir numbers in the thousands of people. And they have joined in uh, to do the choir parts. And it has made this a really special experience. And it's, it's born a brand new community that we never expected and we never anticipated having. But we're all now bound together in a way that feels very significant during these difficult times. I can't think of another project that feels as relevant as the Global Ode to Joy project feels in this moment in time, in this world that we're living in. Some days just feel hopeless, you know, that we are just trapped. We're isolated. We don't have the things we used to have. We're losing people. And yet, at the same time, I see people doing heroic acts of kindness and reaching out to each other in ways that they never did before. I think this is the moment for joy, for us to share joy, for us to cherish joy, to tell stories about joy, and to create moments of joy together. I think Beethoven would be absolutely thrilled with the fact that his philosophy, this ode to joy, is a message that will carry us through this most difficult time.